What if I told you there was one word commonly used to dehumanize Native American women and that Webster's Dictionary defines this word as offensive and outdated? What if I told you an entire town was named after this word? That word is squaw. My name is Roman Raintree and I'm a member of the Dunlap Band of Mono Indians and Chorinumne people. My mother, Gina Charlie, is my inspiration for working to rename our community. When we use language that degrades and dehumanizes people, it sends the message that their lives are not worth protecting. According to the National Congress of American Indian Policy Research Center, nearly half of Native American women report having experienced sexual violence and over one third will be raped in their lifetimes. In California, cases of missing and murdered indigenous women are among the highest in the nation. Our towns and landmarks should be named after things and people we honor and celebrate. The routine use of an offensive slur is contrary to our shared values. Please join us and amplify our call to respect our community and end the use of this derogatory term for geographic naming. To learn more, visit the website below. Thank you.